Hey YouTube, what's up? It's iPod Touch for Life 165 here. And today I want to show you a new app, or not really a new app, but an app that has been in Cydia for quite a while, and it is called Quick Lock. It was recently updated uh, to work fully with the 4.0 firmwares. Before that, there was a way to get it to work, but it involves some extra steps. And uh, this is very simple, guys. Quick Lock, as the name suggests, is a very easy way to lock your device. All you do is click on the application when it installs, and your device is automatically locked. Now, some of you might be thinking, why would I ever want to do this? I really don't know, guys. It'd be mainly most helpful to people that that's uh, lock button or power button uh, is not functional anymore. I know that has happened to many people, uh, such as my friends, and I have uh, gotten that before on YouTube from other uh, people that have uh, messaged me. But, yeah, otherwise, maybe it's just an easier way you can just click instead of taking your pointer and going up. Just saves the extra millisecond. But anyways, what you want to do is go into Cydia and go into the search and type in Quick Lock, one word. And you'll have these two options, Quick Lock and Quick Lock 2. You want to go for Quick Lock 2 as long as you're on 4.0. If you are one of my viewers that are still on 3.1.2 or 3.1.3, you want to go for the one from Big Boss that's just called Quick Lock. Otherwise, click Quick Lock 2 and install it and confirm. And you just wait for the package to finish installing. I do not believe we'll need to restart our springboard for this, but we'll see in a second. Not really a second, since Cydia does take quite a bit of time to reload data. Alright, click Return to Cydia. And we can just back out of Cydia now. And I'm going to look for where that application installed for me. Here it is. I'm just going to put it on my dock, because obviously it defeats the purpose if you actually put it on the page. I'm going to keep it in the center. Click Home. Of course, I got my InfiniDoc here, so it really doesn't matter. But I'll keep it in the first set of scrolling. And now from anywhere, as soon as I exit out of an application, boom. My device is locked just like that. And then I can just unlock it, lock it, etc. Guys, uh, so it's that easy. Like I said, I don't know how much practical functionality it would have since uh, you really don't need to. And you can click the button right here. But for those of you that don't have the button as a functional or you just want something new and refreshing, there you go, guys. So I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure to rate this video as a thumbs up, comment down below, and subscribe to my channel if you're not subscribed already for all new iPod Touch and iPhone videos, as well as the iPad. And I will see you guys later.